Hello and welcome to another episode of Math with Sone. Today we are going to be doing the horizontal line test to determine if the inverse is a function. Okay, so the original function is the vertical line test. And this one right here on number one definitely passes the vertical line test. It only crosses through once, which means the original, the OG, the original, is a function. But would the inverse be a function? Would inverse be a function? And the answer to that one would be if it passes, if and only if it passes the horizontal line test. So if you were to draw a line horizontally on here, would it cross through more than once? And the answer is no. It also would pass this horizontal line test, which means on number one, the inverse is a function as well. Okay? Now, number two, the original is a function because the vertical line test passes. Yes. But is the inverse a function? If we were to draw a horizontal line, yes, we're good here. We're good here. But right about here, we fail that horizontal line test. It crossed through not once, not twice, but maybe even three times. So because it failed the horizontal line test, the inverse is not a function. So just because the original is a function doesn't mean the inverse will be, because the inverse is switching your x and y's, which is why we're doing the horizontal line test. Here on number three, we got dot, dot. It's going to fail the horizontal line test. Horizontal fail. And therefore, it is not going to be a function for the inverse. Inverse, no. Okay? Now, number four, and probably the last one, because if you've watched the horizontal line test, you've probably seen vertical line test. Number four, the original function is not a function. It fails the vertical line test. So it failed the vertical, but it passes the horizontal. And if it passes the horizontal, the inverse would be considered a function, but that means the original would have not actually been a function. It would have been like two separate entities. So here, the horizontal line test still passes, which is kind of neat to see something to where the vertical line test did not work, but the horizontal one did. All right, that's going to do it for this one. Until next time, my friends, I will see you all later. Bye.